<clears throat> hey, this is Gabriel Castro from ExoticWoodPen.com. In this video, I'm going to be making a 1 8 inch thick double guitar pick. This is my template, if you will, uh, just for a wooden guitar pick. But this is, oh, this is my actual template for uh, a quarter inch thick double guitar pick. But since it's just a template, it works great to trace off of. And you can see how that would fit on here like that, right on the inside. So that's sized up just a little bit inside of that. And over here it's traced out on here like that. Uh, I undersized it here so that when I trace it up to the pencil line, that pencil line um, is a little bit larger than this. So then that will make up the difference of this right there like that. So that'll be a nice nice flush fit on the guitar pick and you'll notice I have two different paint stir sticks one is from Lowe's this one is Dunn Edwards this was a mistake right here so ignore that um, anyway the one from Dunn Edwards is the one I'm going to be using because the one from Lowe's is really thin and it's got a crown on it it's not flat so the one from Dunn Edwards is a little bit thicker and it's the thickness that I want and it's nice and straight it doesn't have a crown it's not bowed bent twisted or anything so as you can see I'll be able to get a whole bunch of them out of this you know at least uh, 10 or 11 so anyway I'm just gonna go ahead and cut these off on the bandsaw real quick and then we'll shape them so I'm just gonna go ahead and cut that off right there so I can maneuver this around so we have our pieces cut and shaped I put a piece of uh, double-sided scotch tape on here and you can kind of see it in the in the gloss there and I'm just gonna line this up on one side give it a good press that looks pretty good. Maybe a little proud right there. So we'll just realign that. From the back. So I'm holding it to with my finger right here like this to make sure it lines up. And then both sides right there to pinch it on even all the way around. Cut another piece. Not very big, of course. 
just big enough to fit in there. And now this part here, you want to make sure you get these tips lined up. So you want to put up against a flush surface. Okay, so I'm just using a scrap piece of hard hardwood, a um, piece of purple heart, and this is just a 1 8 inch scrap. And the reason I have this on the bottom is so that the bottom guitar pick doesn't happen to go underneath there by mistake. So I want to make sure that that is flush like that. So actually I want it to be like this. So that I have a double flat surface for both points of contact. Kind of line, line that up a little bit. And then I'm pushing it forward with both pieces. And now applying pressure downward. And you can see how that goes. So that's nice and flush on the tips. And that's pretty much it. So that is a 1 8 inch double guitar pick which simulates a 12 string guitar with a six string. And the reason I'm making this is because of my buddy that I made the original one for. I made him a 1 8 inch one like this and he prefers the 1 8 inch thick versus the quarter inch thick. So anyway, I figured if he'd like that, I know there are more guitarists out there and I'm sure you'll probably like it as well. Anyway, hope you like it. Have a great day.